YouTube, welcome in and welcome back. So today I'm going to take a look at someone new, and uh, this her name is Sarah Milliken. Um, I've done I did a uh, another female comedian a few weeks ago, and uh, I've done uh, Ismail a fair number of times. Um, so yeah, I guess you YouTube decided to send me this uh, in my uh, YouTube feed. So I thought, well, let's take a look at this. Um, and the title of this is Toilet Roll Alternatives. So, <laughs> sounds like it's going to be a little toilet humor. So let's check it out. And I've got a friend who's a doctor. She's a brilliant woman. And uh, we were having one of those lovely catch-up chats. You know, we haven't seen a friend in ages. And you've got the kettles constantly on, and you're putting the world to rights. It was one of those, and it was lovely. And we ended up talking, I don't know how we got onto this subject, but we ended up talking about how much toilet roll we use. <laughs> I think I'd been bragging. <laughs> when my boyfriend's round up mine, we can rattle through a nine pack in a week. <laughs> and she said to me, you're using too much. <laughs> I went, what? <laughs> Is it like a shortage? <laughs> And she went, no, but you're using too much. And then she went, dry, wet, dry. I said, what? Dry, wet, dry. Dry, use a bit of toilet roll. Wet, one of those moist toilet tissues. I don't know what that mime is. <laughs> <laughs> That's scary, because I'm quite clearly doing somebody else's arse, aren't I? <laughs> very thorough though isn't it <laughs> so that's wet and then pat to dry with a bit of toilet roll and I said you know what I'm 36 I've been doing this a long time how about I just stick to my usual way <laughs> and she said and I hope this is how she talks to her patients she said your arsehole will fall off <laughs> but you know there are those times when you run out of toilet roll and obviously the worst time to run out of toilet roll is when you really fucking need some toilet roll <laughs> Give us a cheer if you've ever used something else because you had to. Yeah. Oh, quite a lot of you. What kind of things have you used? Shout out. <laughs> a sock. <laughs> Who's that, that? Give us a wave. Where are you, love? There you are. Happy as bloody Larry they are, aren't you? <laughs> OK, so you used a sock. Um, <laughs> did, you, did you do it like that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, like the saddest ever glove puppet. <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to. That's <laughs> so well done, pet. What else have you shout out? Uh, what was a sh uh, what was that? A shower head. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have to like <laughs> Oh did you have did you have to pour your cheeks? <laughs> oh my god Was that in your own shower? <laughs> was it in your own shower? Yes. Oh that's alright then good. Just, <laughs> it? Oh no, it was just at me friends. Oh he's here. Oh, oh hi I didn't tell you about this, did I? <laughs> so we've got a sock and a shower head. What are they? Spare, spare pants? Somebody who said spare pants? <laughs> Somebody here, that's a good answer. It's another good reason to carry spare pants. What was the fellow over here? Sandpaper. <laughs> Do we believe him? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Is it... What was that, love? You were on the beach. <laughs> and, the, what, and that's where... I know that's where sand comes from, but... <laughs> I don't know if there are many DIY places on the beach. <laughs> oh, you know that beach that's got all those B and Q's. <laughs> Any other things we've used? Hand. Your hand. <laughs> <laughs> Any others? What was that? Boss's Your boss's performance review. <laughs> High five, fella. <laughs> well done. Excellent, excellent work. <laughs> The lady the other day, and I used the term lady as loosely as it's possible to use it, said that she had used a sandwich. Oh, I don't know about you, 
well, but I can't eat Nutella anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you told me always I'll tell you mine. When it happened to me, I was in my flat, and I thought, I'm sort of thinking about the other rooms, visualising the other rooms, thinking, what on earth could I use? Never been posh enough for kitchen roll, but I've always had tissues in. But I had run out of tissues at the same time, and it was like, it's sod's low. What on earth can I use? And then I remembered that I recently treated myself to some flash wipes. <laughs> yes, it stung. <laughs> yes, it was very lemony. <laughs> it was also the cleanest I've ever felt. <laughs> and to be fair, the advert does say that they're for stubborn rings. So... <laughs> I did a show in Belfast and a fella shouted out an answer, but I couldn't quite. He sort of, it was just a noise because he had such a strong accent, I could just make out a noise. I just heard, wah, wah, that's all I heard, wah, wah. And I said, but you wiped your ass on a werewolf, did you, love? <laughs> Turned out what he actually used was wire wool. <laughs> I'd rather take my chances with a fucking werewolf. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sarah Milliken, and thanks very much for watching my video. I'm on tour at the moment with a show called Bobby Dazzler. To find out where I'm going and when, go to sarahmillican.co.uk. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> wow. Wow. Well, with all that said, I really don't want to get into any more commentary on that. But uh, she's definitely funny. So, anyway. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. And if you found this interesting, like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you later. Bye.